women with a history of chlamydia were significantly more likely to get retested three months later when randomized to a take-home test instead of another clinic visit, according to data from the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. For Global Medical News Network, I'm Heidi Spleet, reporting from the Biennial Conference of the International Society for Sexually Transmitted Diseases Research in Quebec City, Canada. The reason we did the study is that uh, since 2002, CDC has been recommending rescreening of women with uh, chlamydia infection three months after the initial treatment. But the adherence to this recommendation we know is pretty poor. So we're trying to find a better way to rescreen women three months after their uh, initial chlamydia infection. What were some of your key findings? Basically, we did a study to randomize women either into the home testing group or clinic testing. And then we found out that uh, in women assigned to the home testing group, the rescreening risk is higher than in women assigned to the clinic-based testing. And we, uh, the, the difference is, is uh, uh, you know, family planning clinic is, you know, is pretty impressive. We doubled the risk screening rates. And in the women enrolled from STD clinics, uh, there's still significant increases in the risk screening rates in the women assigned to the home group. What's the take-home message for doctors? The, uh, the message is that uh, the home-based uh, home-based specimen collection is definitely an uh, alternative to clinic-based screening for chlamydia. Um, we, this probably not going to work for every woman, but have this option for patients uh, can lead to a better race in rescreening women for chlamydia infection. For Global Medical News Network, I'm Heidi Sweet.